What's going on YouTube? Welcome to Life of Cletus. Today I have a package from Sideshow Collectibles. This is my first package from them. They reached out to me after seeing a few crazy unboxing videos to where their team has reached out to me to send me this box. I have no idea what's inside here. It's basically a mystery box. But I do want to mention this beforehand. Yes, I'm dressed like this. I just came back from a uh, reconstructive shoulder surgery and it's only been a week. I actually dressed myself because the girlfriend's at work and this is all I can come up with and it was a pain in the butt. Yeah. So that is some dedication. I'm excited to share this with you guys. Let's unbox it. Oh, it's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be crazy. Let's go. Please welcome Cletus! We have come here from all over the world because society has no further use for you. This place will now be your holding pen until your death. Because death is the only way out. I am a real American. Fight for the rights of every man. I am a real American. Fight for what's right. As you guys know, I've been ordering all of my figures off of one company that I has the best, uh, best bang for your buck, and that's Sideshow for Collectibles. Uh, they do have many figures that I actually own, one being the Cad Bane and the Bounty Hunters. Uh, Cad Bane, one of my favorite figures that I got, and they are on par with the best statue company in the entire world. For me, I buy my Hot Toy figures from them, and why I buy it from them is simple. They have payment plans, they have reward points, and they give you a opportunity to switch over if you wanna have a single payment, if a item is coming in quick, or if you wanna leave it as it is. I do that a lot of times when a new figure like say the advanced suit Spider-Man was in, I wanted to pay that off right away. I do have on pre-order from Sideshow the Bounty, uh, the Boba Fett Mythos figure, which was my Boba Fett to get. I know there's a lot of hot toy Boba Fetts out there, but I just, uh, I passed up on them because the one that I seen at New York Comic Con was the one that sold me. It came with so many different uh, accessories that I uh, said, so that's the one. I uh, can't wait to get that in. I heard the Obi-Wan Kenobi Mythos version of theirs was great. I want to thank the entire team at Sideshow Collectibles. Um, for this package and I can't wait to uh, see you guys at uh, San Diego Comic Con talk about a few things discuss some stuff maybe you guys in the back of my trunks all right we got plenty of packaging <laughs> I think I saw something that I actually was going to buy all right my eyes are closed Oh man, I, I I got a letter. We just got a letter. Yes. Sideshow letter. Cletus Selden dot dot. Limited edition collector's pin on the card from the Sideshow team. Cletus, please find and close some small gifts from the Sideshow team. Looking forward to seeing you in San Diego. Woohoo! As I mentioned. Ah, I think we're gonna get some of that on my trunks. Oh man. My eyes, my eyes. First things first, we got ourselves a shirt. Sideshow shirt. Man, I can see the on the trunks already. Sideshow, right across my butt. Another shirt. We got a sideshow shirt. Uh, limited edition. Pretty cool. Boom. Can't wait to be able to actually wear them. I should put on the sideshow shirt at San Diego Comic Con so then I can walk around as if I worked at yes. <laughs> Yes! Yes! I'm so pumped for this one. This is the Infinity Gauntlet 1 4th scale collectible. I believe it lights up. I was just on their live stream the other day and they just gave one away. Ah, let's check this out. So we have the 1 4th scale Infinity Gauntlet from Sideshow Collectibles that is brought to us by Hot Toys. 
This figure goes for about $100, and I was gonna purchase it on one of the hunt videos where I wasn't able to find a certain figure. Next. Ah, I don't know what this is. It is a 1-6 scale figure. I'm not gonna look at anyone's name. Oh, and there's another thing in here. Oh, this is the greatest. Ah, oh, I can't, I gotta sit down. Let me sit down, I gotta relax. Maybe after I'm done going through this, I might have to do a little giveaway for this book. Oh man. The statues are insane. It's Beetlejuice stuff, Loki. I can look at this book for quite a while. The quality of it is on par to none. It's a great size book. And the pictures on here are in high definition uh, for sure. Now we have this. What is this? I'm trying not to look at the damn box on it because on the box, time to tell you who it is and I'm not sure who it is. Ah, oh, my heart's pounding. I you don't get this excited. I you don't get excited for unboxing videos. And this might have to come into a review video. Oh boy, my heart, my heart. Oh, ooh, ooh, I just bought the Mexico figure of these. Ah, they're getting me, they're getting me good. Because I know I like to complete sets. And we have the Captain America Sideshow exclusive figure. Go and get this from Sideshow.com, I believe. Because Sideshow makes it. I don't know if they distribute to other companies. And this is the license that they have, which is the comic version. We have a little Captain America on the front here, which is pretty freaking awesome. Pretty awesome. Sorry about the glare. And and I have been uh, debating on picking up this series of the comic versions. If you guys followed this channel, you've seen where that kind of series went to with picking up some other figures. But in this one, and this being my first ever unboxing of this as a brand new figure he looks pretty flocking cool one thing that sideshow does that i really enjoy about their figures is this they are the only company that's able to ready pull out the, the hand and put a new one in just like that i've broken a few pegs in my uh short-lived life. I own about a hundred or so figures now and I have been buying them like they're going out of style. Sorry again that this outfit is on par with uh, the greatest outfit you'll ever see in an unboxing video and just limited edition coin. A uh, little thing right here is pretty cool. This book is fantastic. I love the artwork on the front. The figure is awesome as well. I can't wait to do an official review of this. Um, I do like the actual comic version of Captain America. Reason being, he never is going to get old in the future. Meaning, if you are a MCU fan, and you are a fan of the characters that are being presented to you in the films, well, in the real world, there's things called contracts and age and some of the characters that are in the film have that on their life you will always know who captain america is from the comics he's gonna look the same he probably gets a little bit older probably gets a little bit younger but as for a collectible item that you want on your shelf that will never actually go down in value you have it right here with this captain america and the comic versions of these figures which sideshow does have a license for i did pick up their wolverine recently which i really love and i told you about the mythos they do have a deadpool which i do like uh, but we're not going to get into uh, i'm not going to get into all the figures that i do like on there because we know what can happen which isn't great i do like this one fourth scale uh gauntlet uh, it does light up. 
I just don't have a second arm to actually put the lights in because you need a little screwdriver. So I can't wait to uh, put this on display with this figure as well. Uh, in the background of all my live streams. And this book's pretty cool too. Check out this book. Look how massive it is. Look at the detail. Everybody loves Spider-Man. Ah. Oh, that's what Sideshow needs next. They need that comic book version of Spider-Man. Oh, that's what we're dying for. Classic Spider-Man. Please, Sideshow. You gotta have that somewhere back in there. If you got all these other licenses for these other comics, you gotta comic characters. You gotta. You got. You can't be lying to us, man. We need to see a Spider-Man just like this comic version. It's kind of a, like a you know a little shady deal you can do. You know, there's always ways around certain deals. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section if you guys want to see a comic style Spider-Man from Sideshow Collectibles. Um, I do so far have their figures and they are pretty easy to articulate. Um, their fabric has have had no issues with the ones that I currently have from the Bounty Hunters, uh, Cad Bane, I love, probably one of my favorite ones. Uh, the only other character that everybody knows from the Funko movie is General Grievous, and they make that. I'm pretty pumped and excited to keep this thing on, on display, and I'll keep rambling on. So I'm just gonna go play with this for the next uh, hour and a half, and wait till the girlfriend comes home so she can put some batteries in this. Uh, thank you guys at Sideshow Collectibles for all these little gifts. Uh, maybe I'll do a, a in-depth review of all these items in the near future when I'm up to it. I know San Diego Comic-Con is only two weeks away. And I'll see you guys and everybody in the next video or at San Diego motherfucking Comic-Con. Boom! Oh my god, it's getting even better. Check this out. Oh, you touch it, turns on, starts blinking. Touch it, shirts off. Oh my lord. Check that out. Do 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 do. That's awesome. And then this is the one that actually the lights start blinking, each one, each uh, infinity stone. Pretty fucking cool.